Devin Steiner with the women's basketball team here. Uh, they beat Mary Grove College 104 to 44, improved to seven and one on the year and three and zero in conference play. Uh, Coach, just give me some general thoughts of uh, your thoughts for the game today. I thought we did a good job coming out in the second half and, and bringing good energy and intensity to start the third quarter. Um, third quarter has kind of been our quarter this season. Um, hoping that we can, one of these games, translate that to the first quarter and come out that strong in the first quarter. But certainly, certainly proud of the way the girls um, came out in that second half and took care of business and saw some good things from our, our second unit coming in and they really made some things happen with our press. Hannah, you had 15 points, four rebounds, three assists, a steal. You kind of did it all today while shooting six to ten from the field. What brings you? It feels like you have some energy out there. You you pick the girls up. Where does that come from? Um, for sure, from um, just my teammates uh, getting stops on defense and the bench. Um, and then we did a good job finding people um, on offense and hitting shots. Brings energy. It's just all of it. Gotcha. Emily, you were very efficient today. You were six to seven from the field, three or four from three. You also had 15 points, also grabbed six rebounds. You're shooting really well on the year. You're 40% from three so far this year. Where does that shooting confidence come from? Um, I've had to say my teammates, they work really hard and they are really aggressive to give me the shot that I need. And I just have to hit it on with confidence because they worked hard to get me open and I know I can make it. So I'm not scared to shoot. Coach, you had five girls in double digits. You had Hannah with 15. Uh, you had Ashley and Courtney Murphy, each with 11. Emily had 15. Mallory Sewell chipped in 14. That's, you guys scoring all over the board. Speak about the efficiency of your team. Yeah, I just thought we got really nice contributions from everyone who came in the game today. And it was really nice to, um, you know, really get everyone a lot of minutes. Uh, we have a couple banged up kids. We got to sit them a little bit and get them a little bit of rest. And I thought um, it just shows the depth of our team that we really don't have much drop off uh, as we continue on through our bench. So proud of those guys. And uh, they certainly made the most of their opportunities tonight. And um, yeah, it's just exciting, you know, exciting to see lots of kids get, you know, get on the board. Um, certainly happy with, with the way they play. For sure. Coach, last question here. You got three conference games coming up, all at home. I believe Siena Heights and Lawrence Tech are two of them. Uh, and Concordia, I believe, is the third one. What's your uh, what's your guys' mindset going into practice the next couple days? Well, we're gonna be off for five days for Thanksgiving, so um, that always makes a coach nervous. But I do think that rest is also a good thing for us right now. We've we've gone really hard here in this last month. Um, so I think this is a good chance for the girls to um, not only rest their bodies, but to rest mentally a little bit as well. Um, so I think that the time off will be good for them. And I think they'll come back uh, really tough and ready to go. And, and certainly it's an exciting three games ahead of us, starting out with Siena Heights, which is always a really good rivalry for us. And, and they're certainly about the scariest one and six team um, out there. I just, they've lost a lot of close games and they are always come ready to play us. So we certainly um, already, you know, eyes up ahead on that game. And um, definitely, you know, if you can't get excited for those three games coming up, then you shouldn't be playing basketball because um, it's just, it's great to get in the conference play and certainly face some tough opponents. Awesome. Thank you, ladies. Thanks. Thank you. Go Panthers.